And now, a, a great story for you. This is really terrific. A local Vernon it. Hills woman wrote a children's book, a, a story called One Zany Zoo. Now, could she get it published? She wondered about that. She'd been writing children's books for a long time. Today, that book comes out, and you know how many issues, copies are being printed? 2.2 million copies, because that book will be inside Cheerios boxes all over the country, including, of course, in your grocery store in Chicago. Lori Degman is here to tell us how this great story happened. Lori. Lori. Welcome, Lori. Great job, Lori. This is awesome. You, you know, become Mike and I both wrote books in the last couple of years. How come you didn't cut us in on that deal? We could have gotten <laughs> 1. 1. 2 million. I've books, too. You know, you're like Chicago's very own, uh, you know, Harry Potter's <laughs> rolling, yeah. rolling story. Um, no how, how did this happen? This is incredible. Well, I wrote this story about 20 years ago, actually, and then put it aside and took it back out. I heard about the Cheerios contest. Mm -hmm. It was the second year they'd had it. And I polished up the story. It had to be under 500 words, so... I had to make so did sure. So you have to change some wording and stuff because of the times that was had elapsed. Oh yeah, it changed a lot from the first edition to the yeah to right. the final version. Because you wrote the first the book twenty years ago. Okay. Yes, I did. Yeah. Now yeah. let me show, let me just give it's a real big full size book for children, and I don't know if we can get a close up on it, but it's all yeah. illustrated. Colin and Jack was the illustrator. He's phenomenal. And it rhymes. It rhymes. Mm -hmm. And. Why do you think they chose your book out of all the submissions? Wow, I don't know. Um, it was good. It has, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> it has um, a counting element, which um, I think adds to the value of it. Mm -hmm. And it rhymes, and it's funny, and mm -hmm. I think it's funny. I mean, well, uh, lots of pictures, though, right? Like, lots of drawings and illustrations. Yeah, the, the, it, the pictures weren't drawn until after I won. Mm -hmm. Right, right. Yeah. then you say, you know, just tease them, then we'll put some pictures <laughs> yeah. in. Yeah. I gotta tell you something, I heard this on the news, I think it was announced about two weeks or three weeks or maybe longer. And you know, as a as a kid who really the only reading he did was at the breakfast table, and it was the same box of cereal you'd read every day. Every guy's done it. This is ingenious. This is going to yeah. educate kids. The kids will have actually. It's almost like the Cracker Jack method where mm -hmm. you pull the book out right. and you're actually learning something. They've been doing this for years with already published really? books. Mm -hmm. It was very understated, don't you think? Yes, because I never heard about it until I heard about the contest. But yeah. they they've been doing it for years and. I wanted to let you know that they're having another contest right now. It's until July 15th. Oh, beautiful. People can enter. And, um, we'll it's, put a link up on our website yeah, to the entry the stories form. is the program. And it's all, they're taking entries in Spanish as well as English this year. No. So and your book was exciting. published in? The book in the Cheerios box is in English and in Spanish. And my book is just in English. No, That's it, coming okay. out in July. This whole one. book is in there? Or is it a miniature book? No, the one you see through the right. window is the actual book. Yeah. The little one. Okay. That's the actual okay. book. Now, Terry, look, Terry got I, the whole, got I the have dictionary. To listen to that that comes out in July. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah, you can't, that would take up too much Cheerios right. space. But we wanted to show the full book. So small size. You won $5,000 uh, yeah. and a contract with Simon & Schuster. Yes. So, That's I mean, nice. is this the first of many? What does this do for you? I'm hoping. I'm hoping. You know, it's so hard to break in. You know, Simon & Schuster wouldn't even read. You know, they're big. They don't read unknown people. Yeah, uh -huh. What were you doing before all of this? I'm happened? a teacher. I'm, I'm a special ed teacher. Uh -huh. So that's awesome. You know, I'm still working. I still yeah, you know, <laughs> and, and that's something. I'm quit my day job. That's something though to, you, to be a teacher in this day and age and still be working. Yeah. I guess it's a, yeah. I was reading something in the newspaper the other day. You know, when we talk about you know the, the heroes and firemen, you know, policemen, soldiers. Mm -hmm. Obviously, you know, those are people that uh, automatically come to mind. But when you talk about uh, teachers and, and the kind of heroes they can be to young people. A lot of times that's overlooked, but when you think back to your education and how important some of the people that mm -hmm. you had teaching you really were yeah. to you, uh, you know, you realize then what a, what a burden it is that you carry. Well, I wouldn't compare myself to a fireman <laughs> or a policeman, but... Um, now you will have millions of American children sitting oh, at the oh, breakfast yeah. table eating a very popular <laughs> breakfast cereal, Cheerios, and reading yeah. your book. Yeah. That's Last thought on how that feels? <laughs> I'm but speech. The, can <laughs> I tell you something? I, I got to be honest with you. To me, it, it, to, the money's nice, but it's nothing oh, no, no. compared. Simon and Schuster. You probably wrote them before. You probably you emailed, yeah. did every, and you couldn't get a right. sit down. Now you got to sit right. down. You got a deal. That's the huge right. thing. And Cheerios. And two point two million kids are reading my book. Mm -hmm. That just yeah, makes me really happy. Yeah. You know, no, I know that. You have children. 
I have two grown children, 23 and 20. Now, did you make them read every morning uh, at <laughs> breakfast, or, or is this going to be something oh, that you hoist? Oh, did I make them read my book every morning? <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, when they were growing up, did you make the? Oh, well, we was read reading a, lot. a big yeah, part of what you did. Uh -huh. yeah. That's terrific. Well, well I, and one day you'll have grandchildren, and they'll yeah, read this hopefully. book, and you better save a few fresh boxes of Cheerios. <laughs> it's in the stores now, right? It's in the stores now. Cheerios, cool. and small version of the book. Lori, congratulations. And the Thank book you. is all over, right? Is the book? The book will be out in July. July, right? Can I get that copy? You can. Okay. Uh, I don't want to uh, say Terry this. Got the I don't book in here, man. <laughs> All right. Do never give Cheerios still has to sell Cheerios exactly. too. <laughs> thank you. Jim Mills said we like cranking out the cereal. Right. Right. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you.